funny. I'm 25 years old. I race cars. This is what I do. On September 15, 2006, I crashed and broke my neck on a bicycle. What you see here is a little bit of improvisation. We basically electrical tape my hands to what I usually normally drive with the daily driver to be able to do competition stuff to make sure my hands don't lose control of what the whole car is doing. I can't wait to get to turn 10 and just to talk to the guys, to just meeting the engineers and talking to the actual designers of the game and seeing what actually goes into making a video game. Meeting Mario and understanding his story, that's exactly why we do Forza. Bring people together around cars, bring people together with their friends, get people talking about cars. The Forza Motorsport game currently are somewhat limited to just a racing scene and a racing track uh, environment. So the fact that Forza Horizon 2 is what allows you to go and leave the racetrack, go and pretty much explore the world is pretty cool. The idea is that you're on this epic road trip in southern Europe. And you're traveling to the festival and you're involved in all these race events throughout this beautiful southern European landscape. It's got over 200 cars and it's got this huge landmass that you can explore. So you can be on a mountainside at the top of San Giovanni and look across and see like a bell tower in Cisteron and it just kind of blows your mind because it is miles and miles and miles away. At all times, when you're driving a car in Forza Horizon 2, it should feel like the real thing. It should feel like a Forza game. So you'll be able to tune the cars exactly how you want them. For the first time in a Forza game, you're gonna see weather. It's always changing. Day turning to night, night turning to day. Watching the clouds roll in, rain pool on the ground. Seeing your car kind of glitter with the little bits of uh, you know, water beating up on it. It's, it's just beautiful. I mean, Xbox One, we're able to build that social network, that social cohesion between players, and really bring it to life in Forza Horizon 2. So the idea of going on a, a road trip in Southern Europe with your friends is immediately attractive. But when you combine all the different types of events that the game has, everything from hill climbs to cross-country events to point-to-point -point sprints and showcase races where you're racing things like steam trains and aerial stunt shows. I mean, it's just this sort of fantasy that can only come to life in a video game. So Forza Horizon covers your bases with great music and exploration, yeah. but it's more forgiving. It's more easy to drift around and have fun. Knowing that Mario drives competitively really has made his ability to go fast you know, at the heart of, of his mission. And I love that Forza can open up that world to him even more or help him in any way. That's, that's fantastic. Obviously, we love cars, but getting a real passion, that's, what, that's our fuel that keeps us going. Also, I think life should be fueled on his passion, and that's what I live off of, so it's perfect.